how are you guys doing today? I hope you guys are all doing awesome. If you're doing awesome, give me a freaking thumbs up, man. I didn't mean to pressure you. I'm sorry. I did not mean to pressure you. I was just looking through my videos and I realized that I don't have like a My Hair Story video. I'm uploading my natural hair journey video on my two year uh, natural anniversary. So. I just decided that I still want to have a video just talking to you guys saying why I went natural and how I went natural, when I went natural, you know, like just give you guys the ups and downs. So I'm going to talk a little bit about me and a lot bit about my hair. Well for one, you guys know um, my name is Koki, K-O-U-K-I, I am a college student if any of you are wondering. I attend SIUE in Edwardsville, Illinois. Um, I'm a third year student now and my major is mass communication. I think my channel says that my major is something else like business, but I had edited that like a long time ago. I've changed my major like four times. Pretty fickle. <laughs> that was a little bit about me, so now a lot bit about my hair like I said. Well, let's go all the way back to the beginning, how it even all started. Why I went natural. I went natural because I wanted long hair. I was just getting into hair care because you know like it's notoriously known that black people don't care for their hair or you know instead of saying black people don't care for their hair most people just say black people hair can't grow. Black people's hair can't grow but obviously that isn't true because I cut off all my hair and I have hair again that I could sway. Hey. I wanted to prove to the world or prove to whoever cared or noticed that black people's hair can grow and that you don't have to be mixed, you don't have to, you know, have a drop of something else in you because that just makes you better, that gives you the ability to grow hair for some reason. No, that's not true. I just wanted to be that example. I wanted to be like, hey, she's natural and her hair is long, you know, you could do it too. I started transitioning in... I started transitioning my senior year of high school, the first semester of senior year. My last relaxer was on December 22nd, 2009. Yes, I remember that date because I was like, I, I decided that same day that I got the relaxer that I wasn't gonna get relaxers anymore. My whole hair journey started off with me wanting to just grow my hair relaxed. I had just wanted to grow my hair long relaxed, but you know, the more I started to research and the more I was on YouTube, the more I was on Google, I just chanced or I stumbled upon like natural hair and all of its beautiful glory and all of the versatility. You know, that's what really got me. Natural hair is so freaking versatile, it's ridiculous. I can have my hair straight or I can have my hair this long. You know, and I don't even have to do anything. I just hop in the shower. I could have my hair in a wavy style. I could have it in a loose curl style. I could have it in a super zigzag curl style. You know, like you can do anything with natural hair. So yeah, I had just wanted to grow my hair, my relaxed hair long. And like I said before, I stumbled upon all the awesome natural hair stuff. I had just started to get into what you really need to do to care for your hair. Most women don't know how to care for their hair. That's women, period. That's not even just black women. Most women don't know how to care for their hair. You know, for other races, it doesn't really matter. Because, I mean, it matters, but not as much. You know, for the um, straighter texture hair, because their hair can grow longer easier just because sebum from their scalp can actually you know um make its way all the way down to the ends your ends are the most important part because that's what gives you your length so you know it was easy for the hair to stay moisturized but for black people it's not the same it's not easy for black hair to stay moisturized it's just a characteristic of black hair it's dry so dry hair naturally dry hair upon with poor hair care techniques, routines, regimens, whatever you want to call it, on top of relaxers, you know, like, it's no wonder that, like, black people's hair is, doesn't seem to grow long or whatever, or it, it's no wonder that black people can't retain length, like, you're not doing nothing to your hair. How do you think it's going to get long if you don't take care of it? But, um... Yeah, that was a rant that I wanted to avoid. I transitioned for six months. That's six months, right? Yeah, almost six months. I BC'd June 2nd, 2012. 
not 12, but June 2nd, 2010, I just want to be that example that you can grow your hair natural as a black woman and your hair can be long and it can be healthy and it can be beautiful. Don't forget that. I only have like an inch of hair and I'll show you guys now how much my hair has grown. This is the same piece. It's that long now. If I, um, I'll do a length check on my two year natural or whatever, but it comes past my chin. It's about eight and a half, nine inches. So yeah, I think I retained pretty good length for two years. I did a couple of big cuts or whatever, not big chops, but I did a couple of big trims. I guess I'll say that. So I know where those three inches of length went. The first day I went natural, I had like a freaking box cut. It was all standing up and I was just like, you know, I, I kind of, don't get me wrong, I was digging it just because it was my natural hair and it was my first day being natural, but, or first day being natural since I was like four, but still though, I, I, I needed to wet that. I needed to wet it up because it was not, no, it was not the business. I'll show y'all a picture. You know, it's cool, but it, it, it still wasn't what I wanted. So, the next day, I did me a co-wash. Y'all, what the freak? My curls were freaking popping. Like, I was like, what is this? This is growing from my head. I was so happy. I just remember being so ecstatic. I was like, wow. This whole time, this is what my hair naturally looked like. And I was getting it chemically relaxed, so it a lot flat. Like, why? That if you hit a rough patch or whatever, don't give up, you know, look online for some inspiration, look online for uh, tutorials, how to do this, how to do that. There's so much information out there now on natural hair, it's just ridiculous. Just know, I'd say ridiculous, it's just ridiculous. Just know that if you're going through a rough patch, you'll get through it. Just keep the goal in mind. Like I said, my two year natural anniversary is coming up. I hope you guys stay tuned for my mini twist tutorial, my um, my mini twist tutorial, and my natural hair journey video that will be coming out on June second, two thousand twelve. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you guys later. Isn't she pretty? She always comes like to get food or whatever. She's such a pretty little cat. Me and my roommates named her Mippins. I'm just gonna go and make this video now. So, like I said in the video, I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.